Next question is from Bakav Brew on Instagram. Do you, uh, this came in on, on an Instagram story, ladies and gentlemen. Do you miss a step mash at times on your setup? And how do you raise temp at mash out? So everybody's system is different. The super majority of my career, I brewed on a system where I had a mash slash louder ton. So I had my louder rakes and my false bottom. And I would just mash in there. I get my my foundation water above the uh, mash screen, the false bottom, and then I would start mashing in in there. Now I'm working on a system that has a mash ton and a separate louder ton. So um, have we ever missed that? Everything is automated on most. Most everything is automated on the brew house at Sonder that I brew on now. So uh, there will be times where there might be a glitch with the programming or with the, the variances that are built into the program. And maybe I'll stall on a step for too long or something like that. I don't think I've ever had it completely miss or skip a step. Um, and then uh, how I change my mash temperature right now, because we do step mashes, that's done through steam jackets to the side. So there are on our mash ton, which is tall and narrow, uh, there's uh, two blades at the bottom uh, that are very close to the bottom of the tank. And then there's mixing arms, two rows of mixing arms uh, that go up from there. And, um, uh, and that, you know, mixes it. Um, and so as we're steaming, as we're adding steam to those jackets, we're, we're mixing it so we're not scorching anything. Um, and that's how we raise up to mash out. Um, if you're doing a single infusion setup, uh, like with a mash slash louder ton, situation what you would have to do is is you would have to work out your vo your water volumes okay and you would have to mash in thicker which means more uh more grain uh compared to water and then uh conduct your rest at whatever temperature and then potentially infuse uh volumes of boiling water as you're mixing that tank to raise it up to the next state. Um, but the reason why I'm saying boiling, um, which you might have some issues or, or very hot water, because you're gonna quickly get into a situation where you maybe add, you have to add so much water because the temperature difference isn't great enough um, that you can be, that you can be uh, getting to a point where you have more water than you want. Uh, you're unbalanced with your water to grist ratio. Um, that can be that can be a, a, a tough thing too. So just just some things to to think about as far as that go. But with my particular with my particular uh, system that I brew on now, um, yeah, that is that is what I do, and 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 that's how it works. So uh, appreciate the question, uh, Bakav Brew. All right, everybody, thank you so much for watching. If you feel as if you got any value out of the video, please like and subscribe. There are also other videos that you can watch. They're gonna maybe be over here or over here. Appreciate you watching.